all birds are known for their eco-friendly footwear made from wool and trees, but the challenge has always been to find a sustainable solution for the soul. It's taken co-founders former All White Tim Brown and Joey Zwollinger three years, but they've done it. It's a big moment for us and I think it's you know, another step towards finding you know, better ways to make shoes. We've taken what has been a petroleum-based foam, which is one of the most broadly used components in all of the shoe industry, and we've replaced that with sugar. They're showcasing their innovation with the launch of a Kiwi icon, the Jandal. They call it Sweet Foam. It's the world's first carbon negative polymer, meaning it takes more carbon out of the atmosphere than it produces. Here comes the science. Sugarcane sucks carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere and makes sugar. The leftover molasses is turned into ethanol before undergoing a complex series of steps which turn it into a string of molecules which form a polymer. These are molded into soles for shoes. It's really the last piece that we hadn't solved. So if you look at our other shoes, every single other material has a bio-based story. Um, and, and this was really the one major piece that, that had that void. And they've captured interest from some high-profile investors, including actor and environmentalist Leonardo DiCaprio. Gentlemen, you had my curiosity, but now you have my attention. This is your three-year journey right here, laid out in Jandals. Yeah, very early basic concepts through testing all the way through to the finished form. They plan to roll out the technology on all of their shoes, but more than that, they want to share the innovation with the entire footwear industry, with the goal of starting a larger movement, helping the planet step by step. Hopefully it's something that catches on. Sweet. Sweet as Literally. Right. <laughs> yeah, cool. Shoes made from sugar. All birds reckon you can't get sweeter than that. Lucy Warhurst, News Hub.